Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So to begin this makeup look, I'm going to first um, prime my eyes using the MAC Soft Darker Paint Pot and applying that all over the lid and I'm going to blend it with my finger to make sure it's blended evenly. So for the palette I'm using today, it's the Kylie Cosmetics Holiday Palette and the first color I'm using is the color Sugar Cookie and I'm going to apply that all over the lid before we apply any other shadows. So for our transition color today, I'm going to be using this color here by MAC and it's in the color Soft Brown. This is like my favorite transition color for any makeup look. So going back into the holiday palette, I'm going into the color here called Chestnut and just using that color to define the crease a little bit more. Now I'm going into the shadow called Mittens in the palette. It's a really beautiful, like, no, like a purple burgundy color. I'm not sure. And it has really pretty sparkles in it too. So I'm applying that all over the lid with the MAC shader brush. Now I'm going in with a MAC 217 brush and just blending in those colors we just applied to make sure they're nice and blended and no harsh lines. So now for the face, I'm going in with the NYX HD primer and plan that all over the face before we put any foundations on. And for foundation today, I'm using the Estee Lauder Double Wear, one of my favorite foundations ever and it seriously lasts like all day in your, on your face. So to contour my nose, I'm using the LA Girl Pro Conceal in the color Beautiful Bronze. And to conceal and highlight my face, I'm using the NYX HD Concealer in the color Beige. So when that's all nice and blended, I'm going in with a setting powder here, and it's in, it's by Bella Pierre Cosmetics, and applying that where I highlighted and concealed. So while that's baking on your face, I'm going to do my eyebrows. Um, I'm using the Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade in the color Soft Brown. So 
So once both of my eyebrows done, I like to bronze up my face before I remove the excess powder. I don't know why, I just like doing that. So I'm using the MAC Give Me Sun Bronzer and after I do that, I'll go ahead and remove the excess powder. So to give my cheeks a little bit of a contour, I like using this color here. It's from the Selena collection and it's called Techno Cumbia. And I just apply that in the hollow, um, the hollow of my cheeks and also use that to contour my nose. So for blush, I'm using this color by Tarte and it's in the color Exposed. So next, just um, apply mascara to your top and bottom lashes. And for highlight today, I'm going in with this MAC Strobe Cream. This is like the best thing to give yourself a perfect highlight and after I do that I like to blend it with a beauty blender just to make sure it's nice and even and for highlight today I'm using the Anastasia glow kit that glow palette and using the colors sunburst and bubbly for um, the highlights on my face So now for lashes, I'm using these lashes by Ardell in the color Wispies, color, sorry, in the style Wispies, and their style number is 600. Now going back with the color we used earlier for a transition shade, I'm using that to bund out the lower lash line. And now going back into the holiday palette, I'm using the color Chestnut and just to deepen, deepen up that lower lash line a little bit. Now going back into the color Mittens, I'm going to apply that a little bit closer to the lash line and go ahead and just blend that in. So now I'm using a nude eye pencil. You can use any nude eye pencil and apply that in the waterline. And now to finish up the look, I'm going in with this shadow here called Crystal Avalanche and go ahead and apply that in your inner tear duct to finish up the eye look. So for lips today, I'm using this liquid lipstick by Kylie Cosmetics in the color Angel. And after I apply that, I'm going to be using a lip pencil, and that's by MAC in the color Strip Down. So here's the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this makeup tutorial and until then I'll see you guys in my next video.